Let's uh, talk about the market, but I want to talk about this, too. Dave Bonson, what do you think about this Google Microsoft story? My best guess is that Microsoft is just trolling based on what their uh, competitors did to them in 1999, mm. because this is like the exact same thing that Microsoft fought against 20 years ago. The hypocrisy is stunning. You remember that they were going to break up Microsoft because they were the monopoly? And then the whole game changed. I mean, the whole game completely. And Microsoft had kind of changed its business model. So it's nice to see a little yeah. liberal corporate socialism in these testimonies. I've kind of enjoyed it. A little central planning from the boys. Um, fellas, let me ask you this. So the, the Dow's doing very well. The S&P did finish above today, too. And it's doing very well. They're breaking records. But the NASDAQ is not. Uh, people are blaming this on rising longer term interest rates. Could you walk us through this? I mean, uh, why would one sure. in indexes or two indexes do great, but the Nasdaq won't do great? Dave Bonson, would you buy tech? Mm -hmm. Would you buy tech? No, I wouldn't buy big tech, new tech, cool tech. I would buy old tech. Those Cisco's and those IBM's. Intel, those companies that people left behind 20 years ago that are really more value companies than these kind of high multiple growth companies. I think Jim's right in, in what he said, but let me suggest a little simpler explanation. The reason why Nasdaq's having a lot of trouble right now and the Dow isn't is the Dow is trading at about 18 or 19 times mm. and the Nasdaq was trading at about 35 times. There's just a multiple problem. The NASDAQ got overstretched in valuation, in some cases significantly so, and it hasn't fully corrected yet. Valuation still matters. Dave Bonson, last word, <laughs> five really seconds. Nice. Are you, you like the market between now and year end? Yes, no. I like the dividend growers in the market, Larry. All right. That's good. Actually, I haven't heard that in a while. Jim Urio, David Bonson, you guys are both fabulous. Good luck on the restaurants and the dividends.